Who? Who? You know what time it is. It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Holly and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder Jackson, and I am so glad you guys are here. Do you know what this is? It's a baseball bat. Do you know what it does? Here, I'll show you. A baseball bat is used to hit a ball. I learned that at baseball practice. Baseball is so much fun. And the best part is, everyone can be part of the team. You can be the player on the team who catches the ball. You can be the player on the team who hits the ball. I think that was a home run. And you can be the player on the team who throws the ball. Do you know something else really cool about baseball? Kids play baseball all around the world. They really do. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Jackson. Who? Who? Is that a bat with you? Hi, Ollie. This is my baseball bat. I love playing baseball. Baseball with friends is fun. That's true. I've got a story about a good friend for you. Listen up. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Oh. Hi, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. I am so happy to see you today. Look at this. Today, I'm delivering mail for me and my friend Brandy. She delivers mail just like me, but she's not feeling well today. So I told her I would deliver her letters because we're a team. Which reminds me of our story today. Do you want to hear it? Okay, great. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. Today's true story from the Bible begins with a well. A well is a deep hole in the ground with water in it. A long time ago, people would go to a well to get water because they didn't have sinks or refrigerators or water bottles. That means if someone was thirsty, they had to go to a well for water. And guess who was thirsty? Jesus. Jesus had been walking a long way he was tired and thirsty, so he sat down by a well. While Jesus was sitting at the well, a woman walked up with her bucket to get water. Jesus asked the woman, will you give me a drink? The woman was surprised Jesus talked to her. She knew that the people from her town were not friends with the people from his town. So the woman asked Jesus, why are you asking me for a drink? Let's stop the story right there for a minute. Do you think Jesus wanted to be the woman's friend, even though she was from a different town? Yes! Jesus wanted to be her friend forever. Because Jesus wants to be everyone's friend forever. That means no matter where you live, Jesus wants to be your friend forever too, because Jesus loves everyone. Jesus wants everyone to be on his team. Now think about it. Do you think a person can be on Jesus' team if they live somewhere really, really cold? Yes! Show me your super cold face. <laughs> yes! A person can be on Jesus' team if they live somewhere really, really cold. Do you think a person can be on Jesus' team if they live somewhere really, really hot? Yes! Show me what you look like when it's really hot outside. <sighs> yes, a person can be on Jesus' team if they live somewhere really, really hot. What about people who live in a tall building? Can they be on Jesus' team? Yes! 
What about people who live in a small building? Can they be on Jesus' team? Yes! No matter where you live, Jesus loves you. And Jesus wants to be your friend forever. Everyone can be on Jesus' team. Now, back to the Bible story. Do you remember the woman at the well? Jesus told her that he is God's son and he wanted to be her friend forever. The woman was so excited, she left her bucket at the well and went and told everyone in town to come see Jesus because she knew Jesus wanted to be their friend forever too. And that means Jesus wants to be my friend forever and your friend forever and your neighbor's friend forever. Jesus wants to be everyone's friend forever. Hey, Ollie, tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. I'll see you next time. Go team! So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus wants to be friends with everyone, and everyone includes you, and you, and you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus wanted to be friends with the woman at the well because Jesus wants to be friends with everyone. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it? Get it? Got it! Good. I want to be a friend just like Jesus. I'm going to invite all my neighbors over to play baseball. See you next time. Bye.